Minnesota's cow-calf herd continues to face challenges in growth. Managing herds was the topic of the first of nine cow-calf days put on by the University of Minnesota. Experts they, there say even well-managed herds saw as much as a 25 to 40 percent open cows across the country in 2023. Slipping cow pregnancy rates are not helping with rebuilding herds. Eric Musel, an assistant professor for beef systems at the U of M, says continuing drought is a big factor. They would just haven't seen, even with good calf prices, haven't seen a lot of rebuilding of the herd yet. I think a lot of that's just because it's been dry. You know, guys are just kind of wait to see what happens. And we just haven't seen much movement in the price of bread stock, which would suggest that, you know, we're not really back to rebuilding the herd yet. Although much of cattle country has been throughout drought the last few years, 2023 started wetter than normal. Then it got very hot, and that takes a toll on the herds. A much wetter June, and so the grass was higher water content, probably less mineral content. And as a consequence, those cows uh, lacked nutrients to a certain extent. And then the guys that bred in June and July, it was extremely hot, um, and the fly pressure was horrendous this year. Larson suggests adding supplemental feeds, improving pasture forage, and controlling flies. Thanks for watching Ag Week TV on YouTube. Make sure to like and subscribe. We put out new videos every Saturday.